Hey, how we doing? It's me, your friendly neighborhood, Maddie F. Baby. And we're here today talking about Palkia and Pokemon Go. Palkia is now here in Pokemon Go. Palkia is a dragon and water type Pokemon. Palkia is going to be weak to dragon and fairy type moves. Palkia has a max CP of 3,991 with an attack stat of 280, defensive stat of 215, and a stamina of 189. A non-weather boosted Palkia 100% IV out of a raid will have a CP of 2,280. And a boosted 100% IV Palkia will have a maxi or a CP of 2,850. If you wish to unlock a third move on your Palkia, it will cost 100,000 Stardust and 100 Palkia Candies. Palkia is boosted in rainy and windy weather conditions. Palkia's movesets for the fast moves will be Dragon Breath or Dragon Tail. Palkia's charge moves will be Draco Meteor, Hydro Pump, or Fire Blast. Now let's see how Palkia ranks in attack stat in comparison to other Dragon type Pokemon. Palkia's attack stat is 280, which is 4 lower than Rayquaza, 17 higher than Dragonite, 3 higher than Salamence, and 12 higher than Latios. I am looking forward to a future raid day with Palkia where he may learn something like Dragon Claw or Outrage to become a better Dragon type attacker, or something like Waterfall to become a better, a better Water type attacker. If you are fighting a Palkia with Hydro Pump or Fire Blast, you should use these Pokemon Rayquaza with Dragon Tail and Outrage, followed by Palkia with Dragon Tail and Draco Meteor. We also have Dragonite with Dragon Tail and then Outrage or Dragon Claw. You could also use Draco Meteor and you would be A-OK. -okay. We could also use Latios with Dragon Breath and Dragon Claw as well as Salamence with Dragon Tail and Draco Meteor. Don't forget about Latios with Dragon Breath and Outrage or Alone Executor with Dragon Tail and Dragon Pulse. Wait a minute, we got two more little dragon type attackers down here. Gyarados with dragon type moves, dragon tail, and outrage. And let's not forget about Flygon, who has dragon tail and dragon claw. Dragon claw. <laughs> you heard it. If you're fighting a Palkia with Draco Meteor, your best counter will be Guardavar with confusion and dazzling gleam, as well as Togekiss with hidden power dragon and dazzling gleam you guessed it now as you see on the screen my guy andy pandy and i have already duoed palkia we duoed it in rain and it did not have a water type move it had fire blast so it did not have a weather boosted move set we used mostly rayquaza with some dragonite salamance and some latios we really suggest high level Rayquaza, a best friendship boost for damage, and to have fun. <laughs> yeah, have fun. It was really fun. It was raining out there. Me and Andy, we had a real good time. Oh yeah, Andy and I did run into some problems. The very first problem was that I dodged when my Pokemon did not have enough health to take the charge moves, so I got put into the death glitch where your Pokemon keeps coming back up even though it's dead so it takes a long time to switch in between Pokemon basically every time it dies so that's one mistake that I made then during that same first attempt for our duo Andy also um, went back out and his game was just glitching and taking forever so that's not anything he did you know his game was glitching and then I made that mistake the second attempt um, we did it I messed with my team a little bit and accidentally put in a Rayquaza with the air with the flying moves so I made a mistake there and then I forget what else we did during that attempt so it took us like three attempts to get it down so you know it can be a little tougher you know you gotta you can't just go in there all swilly swally and get it done if you're just joshing around you gotta go in there and you know get your good counters in there and make sure that you do everything kind of quickly and now i would like to challenge you to a new raid challenge the palkia versus mawile solo what you will do is set up a 
party with just one Palkia in it, and you will go and you will try to defeat the Mawile. Mawile is going to be two times resistant to dragon moves, so your fast moves there, they're not going to do much. Good luck, trainers. Yeah, Andy had trouble defeating his Mawile because he had Draco Mirror in his Palkia. I guess getting Fire Blast on mine was a blessing in disguise. But yeah, it's just something fun I stumbled upon. I was like, oh, okay, yeah. Because I've always had a fun raid challenges with little level twos and did like the solo Groudon without dying against Mawile. Same with Moltres back before the CPU rework. And those were always really fun. So when I saw the Mawile, I thought about it. I was like, wow, it's going to be double resistant. The Fairy and the Steel both resist the Dragon. So I realized that I had the Fire Blast so that I would have, you know, a nice little, a nice little super effective charge move. So I went and did it. And yeah, it was really fun. Um, um, yeah, just go give it a shot. Use the one Palkia, you probably have to revive him once, maybe twice. If it happens twice, you're gonna be kinda close. So, yeah, try not to let him die. Just get like one or two dodges in. If it has Vice Grip, if it has Play Rough, I don't know how that's gonna go because you're gonna be getting, taking super effective hits from its charge move. So, I hope that some of y'all try the Palkia versus um, one Palkia versus Mawile solo challenge and let me know how you do. As you can see, we're gonna have that on the screen and you can see what my final time was so yeah that's pretty much the Palkia raid video um, the raid guide we're gonna go ahead and uh, start getting ready for the Twilight Cup tournament so tomorrow we'll be having um, a little showcase of a of a Twilight Cup Pokemon we'll be sitting here and taking just one Pokemon building a team around it and running two or three matches so yeah if you're interested in learning uh, some PvP tips from a Boulder Cup champ well uh, stay tuned and yeah hope you enjoyed the Palkia duo the the Palkia Raid Guide, the Palkia vs. Mawile Challenge, and yeah, let's get excited for the Twilight Cup. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new, I hope that you subscribe and decide to hang out with us. We would love to have you. And once again, it's your boy, Maddie F. Baby, and the F is for feeling freaking loved and appreciated, and I hope you do too. Peace out.